What's going on everybody and welcome back to another workout. And this week we're using bands. Lately I have been getting a lot of requests for videos dealing with bands because let's face it, not everybody has a garage full of gym equipment or even have access to a gym because it can be kind of costly. So the next best thing is to buy bands. This is how I started off. I started off using bands you know, um, early on, you know, um, in my whole workout journey as a young little man, you know, and it's brought me a long way until, you know, I started saving up money to work my way up to get just some equipment. So I don't want y'all to sleep on the bands because, listen, these things burn if you do them correctly. So I'm going to go through um, the first three weeks of workout, you know, with these bands. And I'm going to show you how to use them. I'm going to show you. You know, um, just same thing as you doing it with weights. You know, the position of your body, what body parts needs to be tightened up, um, and just also maybe the tempo as well. So just stay tuned and let's go ahead and get it. guys before we start I want you to make sure that when you go and buy your bands try to find something that has the little uh, door um, hinge ball thingy don't know what it's called so I'm called the little door ball thingy because um, it will allow for you to have different variations of workouts that we're gonna be doing later on so please make sure you buy the little door area thing you know because um, in our other workouts when we do our arms and different things of that sort you're gonna need this so again purchase one of these and it, guys, again, it's not very costly to buy bands. You can buy some very cheap ones from Walmart, Amazon, and different um, locations. Play the game sports. If there's one near you, um, probably Target um, and different places like that. So, again, bands are very cheap. So, again, don't sleep on these. So, again, make sure you purchase the little door thing. All right? All right, guys. So, as I said before, we're going to be using bands. So, squats and leg extensions. <laughs> All right, so I really want you to focus on making sure that your feet is shoulder width apart. I want you to flex those quads. Also, keep your abs tight and go as low as possible. So keep that up through the duration of the movement and just go ahead and rack them out. Also guys, make sure your chest is up and at the top of the movement, flex your gluteus maximus. Yeah. Fantastic job, fantastic job. Hopefully you feel a burn in it if you did it correctly. Now, I didn't mention this before, but I do have bands like this that I purchased. Um, and this, again, variation. And this, I don't know, it's a pack of, I wanna say three different um, uh, resistance uh, bands. And it costs probably like six or seven bucks. I think I got it from Walmart also, or again, Amazon. But again, this is gonna be one of the things that we use when we do our one our movement so for our te next two movements is going to be deadlifts and leg extensions these are what we're going to use for leg extension so let's check it out
guys too. Good job, guys, on hitting those two movements. Now we have two more to go. And what we're getting ready to do is standing calf raises and seated calf raises. If you haven't done so already, give me a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, leave a comment, and share the information. Now, if you're looking for a HIIT training or a cardio workout, I want you to check this one out right here. I mean, it's real good. It gets me sweating. It gets me going all the time, and I'm still struggling with it after doing it for so long. So check out that workout. But hey, we ain't done yet. You need to go ahead and finish these last two movements. So let's hit the standing calf raises and see the calf raises. All right, let's go. Well, there you go, guys. We just finished legs and back. If you like what you saw, please give me a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe down there at the bottom. As well, leave me a comment in regards to what you want to see and share the information with somebody else. This is where you at, bro. Signing out.